I'm here to tell you the top 10 things to never do in your relationship. As a personalized matchmaker, I'm gonna help you make your relationship the best it can be, so I'm gonna tell you the top 10 things not to do. Number 10, getting overly involved. Don't go too fast in a relationship. Get to know your partner and who he or she is, because if you don't, you'll miss those red flags and not see those warning signs that'll affect you down the road. Number nine, warning signs. I think we're so intent to make a relationship work that we have our blinders on and think everything is great, but it's okay to recognize those red flags or even huge danger signs. If you have an inkling that something's going on, don't be afraid to look into it. Number eight, second guessing. Overanalyzing everything your partner says will not only kill the mood, but send your anxiety through the roof. Unless you have a real reason to doubt them, just chill out. Number seven, playing games. When you're starting a new relationship, you're always a little cautious, but don't play games. You have to find that fine line between being vulnerable and being a little weary of what could be happening. Number six, the daydream syndrome. The head over heels stage in a relationship is a danger zone. You are so amazed with how awesome this person is that your brain actually overdoses with oxytocin, causing major daydreams about fairy tale endings when in reality, your feelings are probably becoming a little stronger than theirs. Number five, carrying baggage. If there's one thing that's more annoying than actually bringing up your ex to your partner is comparing your partner to your ex. If everything they say or do isn't stacking up to what your ex did, then that baggage will really weigh you down and then you won't be prepared for that relationship. Number four, the interrogation discussion. Sure, you wanna get to know who your partner is, but peppering them with questions is just gonna frustrate them and make them feel like they're under investigation. Number three, holding a grudge. You cannot have a healthy relationship if you're keeping score about what someone did or didn't do in the past. Number two, cheat. Does this one really need an explanation? Just don't do it, ever. Number one, forget about your friends. Your friends were there first and your friends are gonna be there if and when it ends. So make sure you spend time with them during the relationship because they'll always be there for you. There you have it. That's my top 10 list for what not to do in a relationship to make sure it's the most healthy relationship you can have. For more videos like this, check out mode.com.